at the end of some of the long days when we were working on the reporting model and I chose to stay rather than go home, this uh, was my, my bed of choice. You kind of got to be a different breed of cat to do this kind of work anyway. Statement 34, the uh, new reporting model was, I mean, it's as big as a project can get. There was a lot of work to be done and we didn't have a lot of people to work on it. There were times when it was really just me. You know, I'd work all day and, and I'd, I'd go to the gym and work out and then I'd come back in here and, and work and, until midnight or so. And, and there were times when, you know, you just didn't feel like going home. So you worked for a while, you slept on the couch and you got back up and just went back at it again. That was kind of a groundbreaking uh, uh, watershed type standard. We put forth uh, the government-wide statements to show the government as a whole. We, we instituted the requirement for management's discussion and analysis and, and other things in that standard to try and make the report financial statements more accessible to the general public. If you stay somewhere for 33 years, you know, there's a reason you do that. It's a good place to work. It's, it's the collegial atmosphere. It's, it's the importance of the work. It, it's the exposure. Over the 33, 34 years I was here, I talked to thousands of people in, in all walks of life, in all levels of government. We're embarking on kind of plowing new ground in, in standards and transactions that were covered not necessarily in GASB initiated standards but in, in pronouncements we picked up from AICPA and, and, and FASB, uh, FASB literature like leases. There's always going to be important work if from no other perspective than from the perspective of let's make sure that what's in place now is doing what it's supposed to do and that's always going to be uh, kind of active uh, on the agenda.